I mean, I jinxed you earlier and said that you almost never make it back for Barbados. Why is it that you never did stay in a Barbados? Can you answer me kind of like if you want to stay? Why is it you never I, stayed there? I came at home because of duty to nation. I am not extremely nationalistic because that could go left field very quickly. But I am um, um, I'm a staunch believer that Belize can and will be one of the best countries to live and grow and, and raise a family, which is at the very least what we all want, right? A good place to raise our families and to have all we need. And so um, I come back home because it's a duty. Like I feel obligated to come back home. Some days I think, why the hell did you do that? Why are you even there? Why even they are, but um, it's duty that reminds me. I am extremely indebted to this country. And I don't mean indebted in like, oh my gosh, I owe people, whatever, whatever. But there are people who I often say have believed in me for no reason at all. No reason at all. They, don't, they never know who me, they never know what me stand for, they never know my politics. I must couldn't even articulate my politics at, the, at that time. Again, when I say politics, I mean politics, not partisan politics. Yeah. They never know my philosophies and they still believed in me and they still supported me. And so I have to give back because they are still, like we did in the beginning of the interview, when we talk about girls at SA, yeah, yeah, yeah. there are still people who are just like me, who need somebody for me believing in them, who me need not only mentorship but sponsorship, who never who never only need tools but opportunities to shine. And if I could do that for young boys or young girls, whoever it is, mm -hmm. I want to ensure that I am here to do it. Mm -hmm. Because sometimes I'm not just, I'm not, sometimes, I mean, sending money is great. Money is good. No, I never send money. I mean, yeah. but, <laughs> but sometimes people need human connection to get them through. And I want to be able to, to be that person. Not in a messiah sort of way, because I am not our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I'm just Dominique from Comabat Street, Dali guy. But I think I have something to offer the world and I want to share that with people. Um, in between this spectrum of I needed to get the hell out of here and the, the span of three years where I'm a feel a duty to come back. Um, one of the factors, I mean, of, of course, my family. I have an aging grandmother that I feel like I have to get close to yeah. in terms of proximity and geography. But I also like, despite, okay, go back. The reason why when I first started this, this job that I have now as the youngest head of the department in the government, I believe. Um, yeah. Some of the things that kept me back were, I feel like, if I, why people home, they do me wrong. Like if I'm a day abroad and somebody try messing my mind, I may understand, I'm the outside of there. Yeah, but home, I'm the home. Why are they messing my brains like that? Right? Why they try get under my skin? Why they try irritate my soul? Um, so coming home, again, I go back to the duty thing. Like you have to, somebody have to do it, bro. And I know that I don't know a martyr, I know in a cell sacrifice because I want to live a good life. Life they have to Wait, enjoy, but you, you have to, yeah. you have to, somebody have to do it, G. True. Somebody have to do it. Somebody have to come home. Somebody have to stay. A group of us have to stay, not just me, because I can't do it by myself. And I want to leave again and come back. Um, but I've, Barbados made me feel, made me see the world in a bigger way. <coughs> Um, a little island, but it made me see the world. Education opened up my mind immensely. I have to big up two, two of my lecturers, probably three. Dr. Tennyson Joseph, Professor Cynthia Barr Giles, and Dr. George Bratwaite were amazing. Like, I can't repay the people for what they do for me. They make I see the world better, bigger, brighter but also they make I see the world more honestly. Um, philosophy, learning philosophy, that I mean, a huge part of, I think, that coming back home. Because I understand I don't have to take things too personally. 
I mean, the person is important, the person is, yeah. is extremely political, but at the same time, that's not about you. You're about one speck in the grand scheme of things. True. So you have to. So try to shake that, shake that stuff off. Feel your feelings. Not, that but, shake that, but, but shake that stuff off and just do the work. Much more than the worker, the work is greater. That's what Kranich said.